Hello and welcome to Droidbox. Today we are pleased to announce that we will now be selling the Xiyong SmoothQ smartphone stabiliser. We aren't the only company selling this, but with Droidbox you get a full one year's warranty backed up with excellent technical support. You will be able to purchase this from our website and also eBay and Amazon. You can find the links to buy them in the description below. So we are expecting our first batch very soon. It's currently on back order. As soon as we get them in stock, you'll be sent it. Other sellers sell this in different variants. Um, ours comes with a few extras. So what we'd like to do is unbox the product and show you what you would get. So to open the box, you simply slide this across and inside you have the contents. So as you can see straight away, uh, the actual gimbal comes in a hard plastic case. Inside, you've got a full English user manual. There's a USB charge cable. And there's a carry strap. So, onto the case, it has a zip mechanism on there to open it. And as you can see, everything's protected inside. And this is the free access gimbal itself. So on here, you connect your smartphone, which we'll show in a few moments. You've got the controls here. So you've got the on off, different modes, and a directional pad to move the gimbal. And this one here is a zoom in and zoom out. On the bottom, is a USB charging port, which has a waterproof cap. You can see that there. If your phone is running out of battery, you can connect the USB cable and uh, charge your phone while you're using it. The integrated battery, which is inside here, has a 12 hour life on one charge. And on the side is another USB port for the charging of the battery. And on the bottom is a screw hole for the tripods. Uh, this is a standard screw, so it will fit into most camera tripods and so on. So what we'll do is show you first how to connect your mobile phone to it. So with your mobile phone, you simply put into this holder here. Depending on the width, you may need to pull this adjustment up a little bit and then slide that into the end so it's secure. What you need to do next is balance the gimbal. So that's this screw at the back here. You simply loosen it a little bit and then move this slider in and out until you find the balance. So as you can see, it's pretty balanced there. Once it is, tighten this screw up and it is now ready to use. So all you do, Press the red button here, and as you can see, it's now switched on. So what we'll do now is show you a brief demonstration of it. The first mode you have with the stabilizer is a locking mode. This basically, you can keep it facing forward at all times, no matter where your hand position is. So as you can see, I can move this all the way around. The second mode, which is accessed by pressing the mode button twice, is a follow mode. So if you twist your hand, you will see that the gimbals automatically adjust. And this also works for using up and down. The third mode, accessed by pressing the mode button three times, is useful if you're just recording something and then quickly want to rotate the camera to bring it to your face. So simply by pressing it three times, you can bring it backwards and forwards. We won't be doing any videos outside with this, as there's already quite a few videos showing it. Uh, if you click in the links at the top, the video previews, you can see a few of the reviews. Um, if you want to buy yours, you can do so by clicking the links in the description. We sell them on our website, Amazon and eBay. The prices are already very competitive, so you won't find a better deal elsewhere. Please note, they are on back order. As soon as we have them in stock, we'll send them out to you as soon as possible.